Now at 10, Ector County law enforcement is standing behind the FDA's decision to make Narcan available over the counter, especially since it will save West Texas lives. Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Madeline Bierster. And I'm Carson Bush. Just tonight, we're hearing from the Odessa Police Department and the Ector County Sheriff's Office on their support of the Narcan decision. ABC Big 2's Mike Mahoney sat down with the two tonight. Representatives from both the Odessa Police Department and the Ector County Sheriff's Office tell me the public being able to purchase Narcan without a prescription is only a good thing. And that's because they say their mission is saving lives, not locking people up. Our goal, you know, as officers, our goal is not to make it as many arrests as we can or to issue as many citations as we can. Our goal is to save lives. We're trying to think of long-term solutions rather than just, you know, arresting the same person over and over and over again. Corporal Steve LeSueur says the OPD supports the FDA's decision to make Narcan available over the counter, which is expected to happen late summer. The drug can reverse opioid overdoses, which includes fentanyl. And that's a big reason it's part of the toolkit for both OPD officers and Ector County Sheriff's deputies. All of our units are equipped with, with the Narcan, and, and so they all carry it in case of, of such a, an issue coming up. We've had a lot of success because, as you know, as officers, we see things from a different perspective. We respond to overdoses on a regular basis. So we see a side that the general public doesn't see. And so we have been using it and we have had success. Both the OPD and the ECSO are hopeful that increased Narcan availability will be a game changer here in West Texas and hopefully give Texans struggling with addiction that second chance they need to get back on track. In studio, Mike Mahoney, ABC Big Two News.